A few months ago, I was uh, in touch with a, a friend of mine, another expat, that's here in Ecuador, here in Monta area. Uh, he, we were, we became friend, you know, we, well, we became acquaintances with each other, and he, he told me about a camera system that he had, and he thought maybe I would like it, and he offered to to let me borrow it from him and play around with it. It's called a GoPro. It's, it's a GoPro Fusion. This is it right here. It's a GoPro Fusion. And it's a... And let me mute my phone, please, so we don't get bothered. Sorry. And what it is, it's a, it's a GoPro camera system that has a lens on the front and one on the back. It's pretty cool. You can do recordings where, like, say, I, if I'm driving down the road, in my car, I could have this hanging from my mount, like I do the, the GoPro that I have now, and you can see what's going forward, and you can also see me sitting in the car and my passenger just as well. So it's like a two-way camera system. It's a pretty neat device. They're kind of expensive, brand new. They're probably around 500 bucks. But anyway, the whole purpose of this video is to tell you about this and to ask for your help. I had an accident with this thing. I accidentally pulled it off my kitchen counter where I had it plugged in to charge the batteries in it and when it and I, I pulled it off and it hit the floor here in my kitchen and when it did it broke off this little door and this is what helps keep the thing waterproof because this is a waterproof camera system uh, and it's just this little door here but it, you can't see it here because the piece is missing there was a little piece on the top here that latched onto, I guess you can say, a, like a hinge, and then you can lock it down into place, and it keeps the camera watertight, and and it, it also it hides the the USB C port. It protects that USB C port there where you can plug it in for charging. It's an accident. I sick that it happened it made me very uh it stressed me out a lot and so i went on a search i went online looking for a search for this part and i found one i found one on amazon and here here's a picture of it and this was months ago that i placed this order for this thing it was 25 bucks and i noticed that you know after two or three days after ordering it, I, I didn't get any shipping notification or anything. So I checked on it, and and still it hadn't hadn't shipped. And I come to find out that the part that I was trying to order is coming from the UK. And long story short, it's never arrived. It never shipped. I, I don't have this twenty-five dollar part to fix this camera system. Now the owner wants it back. And of course he wants me to make it right. I, I should have rem remembered my own rule about loaning out gear. I never loan out my gear because shit happens, man. People will drop things and stuff gets broken. It can happen. And it's very unfortunate that that's happening here. So if anybody, if any of you people in the States, in the United States, knows where I can get one of these even if it's non-functioning, where I can at least take the door off and put it on this one. Or if anybody knows where I can get this little replacement door out of the States, I would be forever indebted to you. Because I want to return it to this guy. He's a nice guy. He's a hell of a nice guy. He's, I did a video about him, him and his, his business here. I'm not going to reveal him, you know, just out of respect for him. But keep him anonymous because I don't... I don't hold any ill will to, against him, but I can't afford to replace the camera. The camera works, it still works. It's just that without this door, it's no longer waterproof. So I'm asking you, my audience, anybody, if anybody knows where, I, it's a GoPro Fusion is what it's called. There's the word Fusion, I don't know if you can see it or not, but it's a slick little device. I wish I could, I ought to just offer to buy it from him and maybe maybe he would do that but uh, 
That's what I need help with. I need help getting this problem solved. His last offer for me was to give him the camera back in $200. I'm having a hard time swallowing that. I can't see paying $200 for a $25 part for a product that they don't make anymore. That I don't know if they make that. I think they have a new product that, but I think I found one of these online somewhere, or maybe it's Amazon, a used one for like $149. But, you know, that's, that's used and it's in the States and I'm in Ecuador. So if anybody has any suggestions on how to handle this or knows where I can get this part or knows it, anybody have one of these you want to get rid of that you can donate to me, you know, and I will be your friend forever if you were able to help me with that. So anyway, that's what this video is about and that's the end of it. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. Ciao, ciao.